Well, cleanup begins this morning after a protest in Tacoma overnight ended with arrests, vandalized buildings and a fire in the middle of the street. All of this happening near the intersection where a Tacoma police cruiser was caught on video plowing through a group of people Saturday night. King 5's Callie Greenberg is there live this morning to show us the damage. Callie, what happened? In that incident with Tacoma police, it happened right down the street from here. This is 9th in Tacoma Ave South, where you can see some of the uh, graffiti that has been left here on a bail bonds building in Tacoma. Down the street is where the city county building is. That building has also been tagged with graffiti. There are broken windows across the street at the 911 center. We don't know how many people were arrested. We know it's at least two, and I'll explain that in just a minute. But take a look at this video. You can see the demonstrators in the streets last night. Uh, Tacoma police called this a large crowd. This was further down than where I'm standing at 9th in Commerce. A fire was actually set in the middle of the road. Uh, now, this area is where on Saturday night, uh, video on social media showed Tacoma police, a cruiser plowing through a crowd. We know at least two people were hurt. That video on social media also shows that that large crowd was in the street on Saturday night to watch street racing. We asked Tacoma city manager Elizabeth Pauley if the city condemns this action by the officer. Here's what she had to say. We need to always be looking at ways to provide services without causing harm. And, and there's no question that that vehicle struck a person um, and may have struck more than one individuals. And we need to learn, learn what and why, uh, what happened and why. Right now, there is an independent investigation into what happened. We know that the officer is a veteran of the department and feared for their safety when this all occurred. As for those two arrests made last night, what we're hearing from Tacoma police is there were three people that tried to get onto the roof of a closed building. One person got away. Two others were arrested. Uh, police say they had a handgun and knives on them. We'll continue to follow this story, but for now, live in Tacoma, Callie Greenberg, King 5.